So here we are surrounded by creeper holes at the uh, temporary bridge to the wizard tower. And it's ugly. So let's have a look at it uh, close up to see uh, what does not work. So for once the uh, end stone, the uh, yellow texture does not go well with uh, with the uh, cobblestone. It's just too, too different. It goes a bit better with uh, stone bricks, but color-wise, it's just just a huge gap there. So even with uh, the uh, wines overlaid, uh, it does look a bit better. It takes the, the, the glaring yellowness away from it, um, but I don't think uh, uh, this this will do foundation-wise. And then I tried to uh, uh, vary a bit the uh, the uh, structure uh, to uh, uh, come down and up with the with the different block palettes and. Uh, increase uh, stairs and uh, uh, fences and uh, decorative blocks in there uh, here and there also some some mossy but it's the, the whole picture it's 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 very unsteady and uh, it, it does not give a good feel so this looks more like uh, something derelict than something that's actually in use and with what I plan on the inside it should be uh, uh, in use and this should also be conveyed uh, to the outside. Um, but it's not all bad uh, here on the uh, inside we have the ground floor uh, with the uh, nether portal which I have not yet been through. I think uh, nether portal works then this uh, bottom half slab works uh, and probably not uh, uh, end stone bricks but Basically, this makes this uh, whole thing uh, uh, spawn-proof, save for these three blocks, and on top of there, uh, carpet. So that's good. And then here to the side, I have the uh, stairwell. I think it it uh, this also works. Uh, we can cover uh, these gaps with uh, with fences here as well so that should work I'm not quite sure which type of wood this is uh, uh, spruce I think maybe uh, oak would also work birch probably won't work um, acacia probably no and for the same reason a uh, jungle would probably also not work and I think dark oak is probably a bit a shade too dark. Then on this floor we have the uh, uh, storage for all the books uh, with the uh, enchantment table in a, in a side room. So this this works as well and uh, from here on out it it just gets worse um, so then here on the top i tried to uh, uh, do a transition from stone brick to uh, to wood uh, because uh, well the, uh, the the roofs should be uh, uh, wood actually um, but so far it has not worked out and if we have a look from down here uh, we can see uh, uh, the side tower is, is holed up uh, uh, here 
um, not sure if if this works out that way or if it would be uh, better to come down a bit more and then have something uh, uh, more more uh, like uh, cursing on this side uh, which uh, supports the uh, sterile it, it works out a bit a bit better because uh, the uh, uh, overall structure on top is is uh, quite high so uh, uh, it makes sense to have something sturdy in there and I also like uh, uh, these uh, these uh, endings here at the bottom with the uh, end rod uh, that I like that that that's the part that I like but well maybe uh, I'll rework that thing as well. So to uh, recapitulate um, basically the uh, outside does not work, inside structure wise does work, the, the staircase does work, so what I am thinking um, I will put the uh, foundation not on foundation block but basically have uh, this tower sit on top of of uh, a rock cliff and then probably uh, dig out uh, uh, this part here and uh, the part on the other side and uh, basically have like like a ravine uh, going on on either side of the of the tower and I'm not quite sure what to do at the bottom. Uh, do we want to f let water flow in from this side? Do we want to have uh, uh, lava in there? Or uh, do we make it just a, a bottomless uh, uh, pit? And then basically the, uh, the uh, foundation here that would be uh, something like uh, uh, a stone and the side uh, a combination with with uh, slabs and and stairs to uh, give a bit more detail, uh, but basically that would come up to um, uh, about the level where we uh, have the uh, entrance here, and then the the main structure will be uh, uh, stone bricks. Uh, uh, maybe with, with some uh, uh, stone fences and these uh, decorative uh, uh, blocks in here. Maybe uh, uh, throw in some staircases, some slabs uh, to give a bit more uh, variation. Uh, but basically uh, the tower up will be uh, a, a symmetrical structure. And that goes up to uh, the, the, the top, to the, the, the first floor then it it uh, narrows down a bit um, it goes up further and then uh, at the top we will uh, uh, have uh, a wood roof um, maybe I'm thinking to not have the roof sit directly on the stone but have uh, something like uh, 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 wooden framework um, under it uh, so that we have uh, uh, like a, like an air gap but as you can see first step is tearing down the outside uh, then build up uh, uh, the uh, uh, cliff around here and then build up the uh, outside again and probably this needs also some some more thought because uh, uh, in the example of the uh, uh, staircase I did a bit of uh, experiment to to see how it looked I did not do that for this one and I think you can tell so hopefully in the next part we will see some improvement so since the last clip it's been almost two weeks and I have been busy tearing uh, the uh, tower down and building it up again. 
and it does look better. Uh, there are more details in there. Uh, we have the uh, base foundation that's still open to do. Uh, but it looks like something and I have to say it looks even better than I feared it would. So let's have a closer look. Uh, there are still some things uh, open uh, to do uh, so maybe you can see um, the uh, top part if I can manage not to fall off here well that's easier said than done so the top part here is is very detailed uh, with uh, with uh, block variation that's not that present uh, in the in the lower part in the lower part we have uh, stone bricks a uh, chisel stone and cracked stone and up there we have um, cracked stone bricks stone bricks andesite polished andesite and uh, mossy bricks and I think this gives uh, uh, the whole thing a bit a uh, uh, distinguished uh, uh, feel um, on the other side, on the uh, bottom part, we have uh, uh, more uh, structural elements that break up uh, these these walls uh, that are not that present in the in the upper part. But uh, basically, uh, uh, I threw something together for the uh, middle section here and figured out how this what 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 looks good what could work and then basically uh, uh, free uh, free uh, formed the uh, stuff in the, the, the walls between here and I think it it works maybe uh, uh we have to uh swap out some some of the blocks to get a bit more variations in here uh on the inside we still have uh, this endstone brick floor which well i kind of enamored with uh, with the stone floor because uh, i think it goes goes well together with the uh with the uh, nether portal. Uh, what's a bit of a pity now in the uh, first design there were no windows so this room was pretty dark and uh, we had some uh, lanterns uh, hanging uh, from the top uh, but basically uh, uh, a lot of the light came from the uh, portal itself so well it is what it is. Then on this side we still have the staircase. I like the design of the staircase. This this works well. Um, but the, the staircase has to move. There is also still a bed in the way. So if we go up here uh, we are now at the uh, uh, top part of the uh, uh, lower section um, which in here that's be that's already the uh, the uh, third floor the uh, second floor is is down there where the bed is um, here I try to do a bit of uh, um, roofing uh, and breaking it up with uh, with uh, the, the wood texture here 
and then as it, it got smaller uh, we end up with a rectangle or uh, top for the uh, for the uh, uh, top part and uh, as I try to figure out the design for this tower I had a look at uh, various uh, images for Minecraft towers and most of them basically are uh, just uh, uh, rectangular and maybe this was part of the uh, uh, problem uh where the uh the the foundation was circular and uh, and quite big um so that uh, even when we uh, have a look from down there uh, it, it's not really the the feeling of this being a tower is, is not really uh, present because uh, it's it's not tall enough uh, but it's not tall enough uh, because it's it's so wide at the uh, bottom. Um, so what I try to do is basically uh, make the uh, rooms a bit uh, bit higher. Before they were uh, eight blocks. Now I think they are around ten, maybe. And yeah. And here uh, it's all symmetrical. Uh, uh, I played around with uh, with stairs, half slabs, and uh, trapdoors. And I think this worked out quite well. Um, one thing that I'm not quite happy with is uh, uh, here on the uh, outer corner we have these wooden pillars that uh, uh, on each level when the uh, tower gets thinner they move inwards but on here we have uh, these two wooden pillars that just end there and uh, yeah that's it um, then on this side I uh, I started uh, uh, with uh, an extrusion and if we have a look from uh, down below to get a feeling for the uh, the shape that uh, that is holding up the uh, platform I don't really think that it's working out uh, the way I expected uh, I wanted to have uh, basically a, a, a round form that comes out and uh, uh, supports it um, but basically the uh, the the center would be the wall here but uh, because of uh, all the uh, intricate details um, the the inner part of this circle is is not even uh, visible uh, so it does not work so maybe what would be uh, uh, better is uh, to have something that's more diagonal um, uh, in 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 this this kind of shape, and that would basically also mean uh, to have the, uh, the 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 part where the uh, uh, what did I put there? The uh, enchantment table is in is. Uh, spread further out from the uh, actual uh, tower uh, which I think uh, would look great and then once I have figured out uh, this part here uh, uh, basic the same uh, structure for the hold up we will add then uh, on here for the uh, uh, staircase tower
So, I'm back with a new segment and some progress. Here at the back, I ripped out the, uh, the structure here and replaced it. Now, this is, is more in a diagonal line. What looks a bit odd is this uh, quite uh, square shape uh, with, with no windows. But uh, because uh, there are bookcases in there, right up against the wall, um, windows would look kind of odd. Um, I also uh, experimented a bit with uh, with windows with uh, oak trap doors, and uh, I covered uh, these up uh, with uh, the uh, spruce trap doors. Um, added a bit more of uh, details with uh, bells on here and let's have a look inside. Here on the inside we see the uh, uh, shut windows. Um, it's still quite light in here so I'm not sure if if I look at uh, at these fans posts, it seems like uh, there is some light that's that's coming through from there, but uh, not much I can do about that, unless I do something completely different. So let's hop on here. Uh, in here also some lanterns and uh, some bells. Then here we have uh, the walk out to the to the enchanting table. From here it does not look like it's it's that far out as from the outside. Uh, but there you go. Here in the corner uh, some lanterns uh, discreetly uh, hidden. And as this is all. Um, bottom half slept it's uh, basically a uh, spawn proof so uh, there is no real need to have any uh, additional uh, light then here with the uh, with the roof I tried to uh, experiment a bit with, with some forms that uh, looked uh, okay uh, but uh, let's have a look from the outside on the outside, it's it's quite uh, uh, symmetrical, and uh, the nice thing uh, on this side, maybe we can see it from here. Yeah, um, uh, these uh, uh, wooden uh, locks um, they nicely tie in with with this structure, so uh, uh, there is no need to. Uh, do something uh, fancy it without it uh, looking weird. Uh, but I actually have come up with an idea what to do uh, on the uh, other side here. And um, actually I got the, the, the idea for this uh, while recording the uh, last segment. So uh, this is basically a uh, uh, I extended it a bit up at uh, different heights and then uh, put a roof on it and covered it with uh, trapdoors uh, all around, also uh, at the bottom. And we have uh, uh, this on on this on the front side. The uh, entrance is is down there, and we have two on. This side, um, the peculiar thing is that here in the middle we have a bell, and uh, well, it's magic uh, how the, the the towers hold up with a bell in the middle, but uh, then it's it's a wizard tower, so what can you expect? So there's still some some more work to do uh, interior-wise, and maybe also uh, uh, some more 
uh, with regards to the decoration uh, but on this side uh, I can uh, put the uh, staircase uh, further uh, out um, basically doing the, the same thing uh, uh, as on this side so I know exactly uh, uh, how far out it is and uh, uh, at what level uh, uh, the connection to the wall actually happens so uh, I guess I will need to dig a bit uh, uh, out there because uh, the the ground level uh, is is basically uh, set so that's hopefully the last segment of this video so let's have a look at the uh, last part uh, walking uh, to the wizard tower I think it looks great at least from from far it it really looks good um, however it's uh, due to the proportions the the, the the wideness of the tower it looks more like a castle and here the uh, staircase in the back it just uh, looks like uh, uh, an extension or a, a separate separate tower because uh, from here you can see uh, that uh, this part is uh, actually not standing on the ground but structured out like uh, the other extension uh, we've seen before so let's let's have a look at least so far the outside is done I dug down here a bit and uh, down there is a hole with a cave system that's not yet fully explored and as you can see um, counting out it's it's a bit difficult or at least difficult for me I counted down uh, uh, from uh, from this level uh, so that I would go up and then had a, a level uh, uh, could uh, level there uh, but instead uh, on the inside it goes up before we uh, arrive here at the uh, stairwell and uh, it's half a half slab off so this is correct but uh, this should be the the first the first step actually and uh, with everything uh, around here it did not work out then here um, this is a bit of a tight squeeze because there is uh, I needed to put a roof on the uh, uh, gangway uh, below but right above there is the uh, next one so uh, we have here something uh, peculiar a roof that dips in in the middle and uh, usually we have these uh, openings uh, uh, on the side but uh, uh, I think that does not really work that well out here so we have a trapdoor there and then a uh, wall piece to barricade this this up then on this level uh, we can neatly come in here we we'll still need to ha make the uh, 
indoor decoration uh, which mainly consists of uh, uh, chairs for all the enchanted books uh, some uh, anvils and stuff like like that and then here we had a, a similar problem only uh, on the uh, other side uh, because the way the the wall is there is there and there is uh, the uh, window the upper window right there so uh, we could not have the roof uh, go higher up then here on the uh, top level uh, this part is a bit more uh, more open as uh, all this is uh, pretty open so the the gang way here is also pretty open and I like how this came out so what remains to be done but that's a project for another day is uh, uh, digging out the uh, terrain around it and uh, make a cliff and then also a proper bridge uh, over there uh, but yes so the next thing I will uh, focus is or the next thing on the agenda is getting more uh, uh, villages I still need uh, some librarians uh, but the uh, first deck is uh, full so uh, or at least full of librarians there's still a few cells left uh, that I want to to fill with uh, stonemasons, uh, weaponsmiths, toolsmiths, uh, these kind of things, and then we can have a second floor with more librarians. Um, but for this, I basically need a lot of gold and. Uh, Digging up gold is quite tedious, so uh, maybe gold farm could be the next project. Uh, but I have not yet looked into any designs. But that's all for now. Thank you for watching. Bye.